This is how you can make iodine, which is a pretty toxic element. We use sulfuric acid and potassium iodide to make this scary purple gas of iodine. Also, if you see this on your For You page, please let me know and follow me to see crazy experiments. My PhD in synthetic organic chemistry, which I think is really cool because that basically means that my whole expertise is just making molecules that don't otherwise exist in nature. The coolest molecule I ever made was this molecular Mobius strip. This is an example of a Mobius strip if you just like look on Wikipedia. It's a single-sided, unorientable surface. Uh, there's another one. I made a single molecule that just like is that shape. Oh, there she is again. So cool. If you shine a black light on it, it glows blue. It fluoresces. Come on, look at this behemoth of a molecule. In my final defense, one of my committee members told me it reminded him of Dr. Seuss. This is a computational model of the electron delocalization. Somebody show Hank Green my molecule. He's a chemist, he'll care. Oh, that's loud. your ice tray like this. I wanna do that! It flashes everywhere, it takes forever. You know why? The way to do it is hold it on an angle, angle? put it under the water, and it will fill it. What the fuck? That actually worked! Wow, this guy could fix uh, climate change. He could cure cancer. He could save the world. Wow! You know how I used to have four hand boilers? And I only have three because one broke? Guess what? I got the purple one again. And I also just realized that you have to be 14 years or older to use one of these. Probably because they're so delicate and they break when you literally just touch them. But let's open it up. It has some bubble wrap inside because these are really delicate, you guys. I'm going to emphasize that. Oh, fancy. Look how beautiful it looks. Never been used before. Let's try it out. Oh my gosh, it's perfect. pounds and he battles offensive linemen who average about 320 so our 160 pound lab rat is clearly in way over his head the peak of his flight John's head was almost nine feet off the ground. Aku bayang nggak kalian tersesat di hutan dan udah aus banget tapi cuma ada air kotor. Inilah ilmu yang mungkin nggak berguna tapi coba tonton aja. Bukan nyumpain tapi suatu hari bisa aja berguna. Caranya itu kalian bisa bikin penyaring air darurat. Pertama kalian bikin dulu wadah kayak gini, terus masukin bahan-bahan berikut. Di paling bawah masukin dulu potongan ranting-ranting pohon. Terus tumpuk pakai batu kerikil, masukin pasir, terus masukin arang, kasih lapisan pasir lagi, dan kemudian masukin batu-batu yang bentuknya itu kayak gini. Sekarang tuang airnya dan selamat kalian udah dapet air yang lebih bersih. Tapi ingat air bersih yang disaring ini bukan air minum. Kalau mau diminum tetap mesti perlu dimasak biar steril. Jadi semoga berguna dan stay curious.